G'day everyone, and welcome to my fit my first tank profile video. I am going to begin the series as a pre-war World War II era German Panzer series. The first tank today is the Panzer I. Panzer I was the <coughs> the first tank to be built in the series of Panzer Kampfwagen, the main German battle tanks to fight World War II. The Panzer I was designed by Krupp Company in 1930 and received an order for 150 training tanks in 1933 with the following 1000 combat ready Panzer I A's by no 1934. Using the Panzer I A variant as an example, the size of the Panzer I was very small so the amount of crewmen was limited to two people who are the driver and commander. This made the commander's job a bit harder as he had to command the tank as well as load and fire his main weapons. The armour on the Panzer I was only a, a maximum of 13mm on the front plate with, which meant the tank could be easily destroyed by anti-tank rifles. So it's, And so its role was limited to reconnaissance and scouting. The armour consisted two times 7.92mm MG13 machine guns in a fully rotating turret. With the armament being MGs, this was another factor limiting the Panzer I to infantry support. The number of Panzer A is produced was around 800 units by the end of 1936. The A variant was very much limited by its own components, plus suffering from overheating, engine problems and suspension issues. The B variant was set out to iron out those problems. This was done by extending the chassis, adding another bogey to the improved suspension, a new gearbox, and a new, more reliable, water-cooled six-cylinder Maybush NL38 engine. The armor and armor stayed the same. The Panzer I's, com uh, Panzer I's first combat engagement was during the Spanish Civil War at Madrid whilst fighting alongside the Nationalist forces, fought the Republican T-26 ascent from Russia. Although the Panzer I was inferior compared to the T-26, the Nationalists won the battle. The Panzer I also fought during the Second World War from 1939 in Poland to 1941 during Operation Barbarossa in Russia. After fighting the Ru the Ru Russian T-34s and KV-1s, the Panzer I was relocated to policing roles and some were converted to special vehicles, including munitions vehicles. This was, uh, there were many variants of the Panzer I, being A, B, C, D and F variant uh, models produced, as well as special vehicles including the already mentioned munitions vehicle, AA variant, the Flak Panzer I, which housed a 20mm flak cannon, the Panzer Belswagen, a light command vehicle with a fixed superstructure. The Panzer Jaeger I, a dedicated tank destroyer housing a Czech 47mm cannon. And the heavy artillery carrier housing the 150mm SIG 33, nicknamed the Bison. Although the Panzer I suffered many shortcomings with the limited armour and armour, the tank served its purpose for re rebuilding the German ar army under Adolf Hitler's rearmament program, providing, the mu providing much needed battle experience and a base for the future Panzer, Panzer series. My alias is Pe Phoenix Oz and this is the end of my first tank profile video. I hope you enjoyed it. Please remember to support my channel with a like and subscribe as it helps you guys for future content. Thank you for watching.